How's it going, guys? My name is Mr. Sonic Menu, and welcome back to another episode of Limbo. So, last episode, we found out some crazy stuff. We found out we could get infected by the headworms you guys see over to our right, and some crazy things happening with the weather machine, and the setting is changing, which is very interesting. I'm excited to find out what happens later on in this game. So, you know what? I'll stop blabbing. Let's get started. Okay, so last episode I was having trouble with this worm. I have no idea what to do. It's honestly pretty confusing. Especially when you're someone who's not smart, like me. I don't know what's going on. Okay, that didn't work out for anyone. Alright, so we have to find a way to make this light over here shine so we can shake these headworms or maybe I need to time this maybe I need to go to the box at a perfect time so it won't get on me okay that works alright surprisingly it worked I had no idea that would work how come I didn't think of that last episode okay the headworm gonna make me go over to the right, and hula! Ah, light, no! Okay, let's go over here. Boom. Okay, what's this headworm gonna make me do? Gonna make me keep on going up, right? Um, okay. I'm gonna go down? What's down? Okay, apparently down is death. Okay, down is death. Down, don't, oh my gosh. Alright, um, eh, same as before, get infected, oh my gosh, I'm infected. Let, let's go, it's so gross. But it's so cool, all at the same time. So the light gives me temporary control of the kid. Temporary control. But I'm not sure... So, my theory is, like, there's worms in inside, also. What if the worms they use on the pigs in inside is, like, some sort of evolved version of the worms in inside? Like, what if that's the case here? What if? Oh, shoot. It's rising. What the heck? Okay, we're getting that box, aren't we? Yeah, we're getting that box now. It's like now ish. Oh! <laughs> ah, why did I not see that coming? I'm so stupid. Oh boy. Oh, Nelly. Okay, back this way. We know what to do now. Let's hurry up and get out of here before we straight up die. I don't want that to happen. I know what to do. Come on, hurry up. Hurry up. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. The water's rising. Come on, hurry. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on. We need this box. Do we actually need that box? Do we? Oh, we don't. Oh, there's something rising over here. Maybe we can use that. Come on, rise, f rise faster, please. Thank you. No. Oh! Okay, we should have waited. We should have waited on that. I feel stupid now. Okay, here we go. Again, again. We like I said on the first episode. Um, I'm gonna try to keep this as uncut as possible. I am gonna cut it when I find it necessary. So excuse the, um, if it's not like the other videos I've edited where I cut out a lot of it. It's just I wanted you guys to have the same experience as me. And also, um, that's why I kind of cranked up the volume to the music. Because I want you guys to experience the same kind of, uh, have the same kind of experience I am. So that's why, just in case like it's your first time watching this 
the series. I don't know why you wouldn't start with part one, but just in case, this is why, if you didn't know, this is why I'm, I have it almost uncut. So there, there you guys go. The reason why. Okay, we gotta wait. We gotta wait for it to be high enough so I don't get on those, so I don't get killed by those spikes. Because these worms make me crazy. I lose all sense of logic, apparently. We are free, and we need to run. We need to get on out of here. I don't know, the setting kind of reminds me of, um... You guys hear that game, um, Rain World? I don't know, the rain kind of reminds me of it. And the fact that we need to be, that we were climbing up ladders and all that. I haven't played it yet, but I saw Markiplier play it. It kind of reminds me of that game. It looks like fun, too. I really want to play it. But, um, you know, I'm a broke college kid. I don't, I don't have $20 to just spend out of nowhere. Oh, jeez. Okay. <laughs> I thought I was stuck there for a second. So, yeah, I want to play that game. Let me know if you guys will. So, maybe I'll save up the money to buy it. Oh, this is going to be a bad idea. Ah, I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. I was going to screw up there somehow. So, hotel. Hotel. I knew it. Ah, oh, that was bad. That was so bad. Okay, maybe there's something um, down this pipe that we need to discover to turn off the power. Maybe. Or is that there just to troll us? Maybe the gap was placed there just to troll us. Maybe it wasn't the hotel sign. Can you time this right? One, two, three, four. It's not gonna work. It's definitely not gonna work. Okay, maybe there's something over here on the left that I'm missing. There can't be because the pipe is broke. I need to wait on here, on the pipe, and I can hop over. That didn't work. Wait a minute. Hotel. Does that mean Limbo takes place and has a post-apocalyptic setting? You guys know how I feel about post-apocalyptic settings, man. Ugh. What am I supposed to do here? I don't get it. What am I supposed to do? I love you, Limbo, but sometimes you get on my nerves. Oh, oh. oh yes. All right. Okay. Oh, there was a rope there. I know what to do now. Can you see on my face? I know what to do. <sighs> it's just, you know, it's not the game. It's just knowing that the reason why I'm dying is because it's my own fault. That's what's getting me angry. The fact that I'm stupid enough to let the game kill me. That's the frustrating part. Oh! That almost got me there, dude. That was a close one, man. Okay, okay, see? That's another cool thing about this game. When you die, you gradually figure out what you're supposed to do. It's kind of like Dark Souls where every time you die, you learn something new about the puzzle or about the enemy you're trying to kill. Or in Dark Souls case, uh, the enemies and the bosses. This is cool. I like this game. It's like a trial and error kind of puzzle solving style it has. And that's what I really like. Doesn't require you to have a whole lot of tools and stuff. Kind of like Zelda where you need to explore the dungeon. So, you need to explore it to its fullest so you can get the item you need to explore the rest of the dungeon. It's not like that. It's more like um, trial and error kind of puzzle solving, which I'm a huge fan of. I really like. I don't think there was a game I played where I had that. I wouldn't really count inside in a minute will this topple over no no no
And... This is not going to work. <laughs> okay, I thought that would work. Never mind. Okay, maybe... We have this up here. It was up here at first. Maybe we can climb it up. Up. No, up. Okay. okay. Maybe we're supposed to let it go. We're supposed to push it. And we knock down the ladder. What am I supposed to do, man? Okay, let's see what's down here first. I'm supposed to break this, huh? Okay, I'm supposed to break this. Am I, am I really supposed to break this? For some reason, having my dust, I'm supposed to break this. Oh. That's what the ladder is for. I have more weight to myself if I jump off the ladder onto the glass so I can break through. Clever. Very clever, Limbo. All right. So I need to put this all the way up here. Don't, don't squash me, please. And then at the right moment, I need to hop off. But that wasn't the right moment, though. Okay, let's, let's give this another go. Let's see if this works this time. Oh, shoot. I was up too far. Okay, is this the one where I make it? Is this the one where I make it? Ah! Yeah! It's the one where I make it. Oh, lights. We all know what that means. Never mind. I thought that means... Oh! Am I dead? Oh, I died from that one. I have to do that over again? Okay, guys, hold on. Let me do this all over again. I don't want to waste your time with this puzzle again. So... Okay, we're back. No, 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 no. Hop. 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 Come on. Come on. Come on. Let me down. Let me leave. Oh. Oh, it worked that time. Okay. <laughs> I thought I was going to die. Oh, oh, dude, no! Okay, that nearly killed me! Up! The arrow is pointing up! How do I get up? I don't think I'm supposed to go up there. I have a strange little hunch that I'm not supposed to go up there. I feel I'm supposed to go back up there where I found the hose. But I need... Okay, worm. Okay, worm. Oh, jeez, this way. Uh, this way. I need light. Come on. Give me light, game. Give me light. Is that light up ahead? Oh, yeah. God, I'm really liking these head worm puzzles. Oh. Okay. Limbo is kind of unforgiving when it comes to the puzzles because I heard like there were some parts of Limbo that were before like I played it there were some parts in Limbo um, that were just ridiculous like they were they would kill you and they were yeah like I said they, would, they weren't very forgiving in the game from what I heard from other people that played it okay what is this? What am I looking at here? Oh, jeez. Hop. Oh, God. What am I looking at? What is all this? Yo! What's that? I'm supposed to push the button. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. I messed up big time! Okay, so I know what to do now. Hopefully, I remember I need to push the button.
Yo. Ah. The, the fudge? What the what was that? What? Okay. Okay. Hold back. Hold back. Hold back. I get it now. I was supposed to go on top of the box so I could hop over the saw. Okay, makes sense. It makes sense now. It makes complete sense. Alright, buddies. Let's do this. Let I am enjoying this game. I love dying a lot. I love making myself look stupid in front of you guys. This is a great game. 10 out of 10. Okay. We made it. Here you go. Alright. Alright. Oh no. Oh! Oh, thank god. We don't have to start this all over again. Well, now that's activated. And I have to wait over here. Or do I? Do I? When will it come back? Right now! Okay. <laughs> that freaked me out. Running away from the saw blade. Okay. I can't depress the button either. Which is kinda lame, if you ask me. That was clever to put the worm there, and so I could be in more despair when. Shoot. Shoot. Okay, that wasn't scripted. That was not supposed to happen. I wasn't supposed to do that stupid of a thing. Okay, but how am I supposed to go about this? Okay. So if it's on one side. Was I supposed to use something that could help me? I'm supposed to make it like a teeter totter? That didn't work. Okay, so we're just supposed to rock it. Right? Just rock it back and forth, right? Back and forth. Back and forth. Back and forth. Back and forth! See? I think I'll use back and forth as a title, because I go back and forth from dying and living. No, I go back and forth with the dying. There we go. There we go. Okay, um... The teeter-totter puzzle is kinda... Uh, tedious? That was, that was a bad joke. Okay, I'll shut up. <laughs> Please don't break on me. I won't forgive you, game, if you break on me. Come on, come on, come on, come on, yes! <laughs> oh, jeez. Okay. Okay. The next time around, I could hop on over, right? Okay, I had a fe- I didn't know I was gonna make it there. Alright, uh... Okay, now we just need to backtrack, because when we were infected with the bug, we just kept on going and going. Okay, um... Alright, that's cool with me. Guess we're gonna head on up. What was that? I have a feeling I should be concerned. What's that for? Oh! A rope! A rope for what? Okay. I mean, that's a start. Right? Uh... Can I head down now? Okay, this puzzle is interesting. I have a feeling I can't go further. 
Yeah, I can't go down any further. Okay, so... We'll leave that there. Let's check to see... Oh! There's a box. I need a box. Okay, I forgot about the box when I was heading on over here. Okay. Let me push the button. Push. Okay. I want to hold on to it, just in case. Because this thing is basically my baby. Little boxy. Little bend the box. Oh, jeez. <laughs> I need to push it the other way. Oh, okay. I like how he automatically just latches on to edges and stuff like that. It's too funny. This is a problem. This is a problem. Okay. Maybe our little teeter-totter here could give Ben a push. Maybe not. Okay, maybe I could somehow balance it out. But the box is heavier than I am. How am I supposed to go about this? Maybe there's something else I need on the far side. There's probably something else I need on the far side. So maybe I need this box. Oh, I thought the box was going to kill me. Okay, so maybe I don't need this box yet. Maybe I just need the box for now to help me get back over here. Because I have a feeling I'm getting ahead of myself. And this episode is going to be a lot longer because I feel like we didn't really do a whole lot this episode, so I'll, this will be longer. So I apologize in advance if it's too long. Um, is there a box over here? I can't remember for the life of me. Yeah, I don't think there was a box here. The, yeah, there's absolutely no box here. Oh, yay, Limbo and your puzzles. Oh, wow. Okay. Um, I'll be back, guys. Yeah, see you soon. Okay, one thing I like about this game is the mystery behind it. Like, from the moment I stepped foot inside this facility, I was thinking, what happened here? Like, what could have gone wrong? What kind of factory was this? It looks very much like a factory. So excuse me for assuming. But this seems like... The kind of place where... They... Like a manufacturing... Factory? I suppose every factory is, a manufa is for manufacturing, but... This is... It's interesting. Because... One, they had the worms. Two, they, uh... It said a hotel up on it. So maybe this isn't a factory it's a hotel, but... What kind of hotel has a strange... Um, what do you call it? No, 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 no. What kind of hotel has a saw blade in it? Know what I mean? Okay, I had a thought. Hopefully my thought is correct. Okay, I'll show you guys. So, we bring the box over here. We head on up. Um, I raised the, the rope. Maybe that has something to do with how this box gets, gets over there. Maybe when the rope goes up, it moves the box. I mean, it comes down. It moves the box. Maybe not. Okay, I'm onto something here. I think. There's a rope up. Oh. Um. Oh. Hey. Oh, how come I didn't figure this out before? Is that it? 
Or just swing? Like Tarzan? What is that? Is that all it did for me? Really, game? I thought I was gonna solve the puzzle. So, after much trial and error, I think I've been at this for half an hour already. But I think this is what I'm supposed to do. Right? Actually, I don't. I'm starting to have my doubts. I don't think that's what I'm supposed to do. Maybe if I. So. I've been at this puzzle for nearly 45 minutes. I have no idea what I'm supposed to do, but I'll leave it right here. If anything didn't happen or not a lot happened, I'm sorry. It's just, I don't know what to do. I've been at this puzzle for a very long time, so I decided, you know what? I'll just end the episode right here, and I'll just pick it up again from here. And the next one, and in the meantime, I'll figure out what I'm supposed to do. So... I won't have to be struggling and stressing and getting frustrated over this certain puzzle. But anyway, thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you do, make sure you hit that like button and let me know in the comments down below what your favorite part of this episode was. But anyway, this is Mr. Sonic Menu, signing off. See you guys.